My butthole's clenched. Hey guys, welcome back to Capadre Amigos. I'm Captain America. No, you're not. I'm, I'm Caleb. I'm Nick. And I'm Kronz. And I'm also, I guess, going to be playing the bulk of the rest of Dark Souls. Just so we can get it done in a reasonable amount of time. Because, see, we don't want this to be a series that goes for, like, seven seven or eight months purely because I'm incompetent. <laughs> and Caleb is trying to get used to the control scheme past the point where it expects you to know everything. Yeah. And, because, uh, you know, I've seen a few uh, Dark Souls walkthroughs that are, like, a hundred parts. And we're thinking we can get through this in about... 40 at the most. Maybe a, give or take a few. I think like 40, 46 is what I estimated, but. Whatever. We'll see. Okay, so with the transient curses, we're going to go through New Londo. In a. In a fight. Some ghosts. <coughs> Clearly. Gazunta. <clears throat> Bless you. Blessed be thou. Or I guess I can't really bless you. I'm not a priest, but... Yeah. It's weird. Nope. New Londo, I always thought was kind of creepy, just because it's like... You usually don't have any music in other areas of the game, but in New Londo, it's just like... There's no music, but you hear this... Every once in a while, it's just like... Huh. Mm. You can, uh, don't, do ghosts sometimes drop transient curses? It depends on your item discovery. They can. Okay, so they, that's, that's what I was looking for. Yeah. I was like, even, can, can they even? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. They do yeah. have a drop chance. But we which don't is have much higher enough item discovery for it. Yeah, it's much higher if you have, like, ten humanity. Much, ten humanity and covetous gold serpent ring. They're much more likely to drop their pants. What? <laughs> <laughs> they don't even nah. have pants, Caleb. Shows and besides, you, it, haven't you ever seen Ghost Hunters and the episode with the killer pants? No, I haven't. Neither have I. Weird. Yeah, that dude is sitting around the corner waiting to mess you up, so be careful of that. You can't actually, you cannot actually pull this lever yet. You have to, there's fucking, there's water down there, I guess. I don't know. Nick has never jumped down to find out. It's true, I haven't. Because he's not stupid. I yeah. don't know. There are some points in this game where you're like, oh, if I fall down there, I'll die, but you actually have to fall down there. Like, into Nito. Yeah. Or Four Kings. Yeah. Or Stray Demon. Yeah. Of um, course, that's not really falling down voluntarily. You're just kind yeah. of walking along, and then you just... And then oh, the floor no! collapses beneath you, yeah. Unless you weren't expected, because it, it, when you're not expecting it, you're pretty much dead. And then you... Yeah, ghost in the wall. What a bitch. Yeah, take that. Parrying. You have a parrying dagger here, which is... You can use it to parry, kind of like what Lotric does. If you but you it, parry, gets a, yeah. it gets a bonus for criticals. And if, so you, isn't it true that if you, if you par if you manage to get a parry with parrying dagger, you auto repost? No, that's no. not true. Uh, I thought Be I careful of these. I, I thought chicks. I remembered seeing that once. Oh, ew! Gross. Banshee. Yep. Banshees will scream and they'll summon other ghosts. I think. I don't know. It's just annoying. And isn't that Banshee's whale supposed to kill the living? I don't know. It reminds me of my ex girlfriend though. Ooh. Oh shit! Ah oh, snap! Oh. 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 Ooh. Shortcut. Ooh. Oh. Ah. Oh. E. Ah. I owe you. And large What do you owe me? Soldier. I don't know. I don't owe you anything. I think the things that I have These guys purchased recently make I want to make up for any previous deaths. Stretchy ass arms. Okay. Hey, what about your purchases? No, wait. Hold on. What's out in the middle of the lake? Like good thing. The this statue, statue of somebody? Yeah, that's how you get to Four Kings. Oh. Yeah. Oh, oh! Ah! Gosh. Who is the statue of? Do you, do you guys know? A chick. Um. Yeah, it's of a girl, but I don't know. What? One health? That's dumb. What? 
Oh my god, so many ghosts. This is... This bitch tits right here, gentlemen. Why do they get scythe arms? It's not fair. Don't you know that all ghosts get scythe arms? It's the... Eisenhower's third law of ghosts? Yes. All ghosts get... Well, what are the other two? Third law is all ghosts get... Get, uh... Get scythe arms. His first law is that... One out of every thousand go, go every thousand ghosts is a friendly ghost. Casper. Yes. Or, um, oh hey, look at this dude in the wall. What's funny is that he always drops a transient curse or something. At least in my experience, I guess not this time. No, of course not. But it's like too high for you to get. It's, it's annoying. And then all right, the second law. What's the second law? All ghosts like to float out of your reach. No, because some ghosts they can like walk, to get Isn't it that they can walk through walls, or is that a later law? Incorporeality. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah that could be the second rule, but I feel like that's not nearly as creative. Like that, that's that's obvious. That's like a given. Let's see what that's, um, mm. that they sound like old men. Yes. Second law of ghosts. They all sound like old men, even the women. Especially the women. Eustace, where is my cup? Eustace, where is courage? Stupid dog. She made me look bad. Yeah, I love that show. I think we went over this before. Yeah, we did. Yep, uh, we certainly now did. Now where? Oh shit. They're rising out of the floor. Yep. Be prepared for a brawl here. They're coming out of the floorboard. You know all the ones that I killed earlier? I was supposed to fight them here. Nick was just... Nick they just, just knew all, this was coming and... No, they just all heard me and was like, Hey, let's go kill him. And then I'm like, uh... uh How about no? Uh... uh so you want to go up... You, yeah, you want to go up the ladder <laughs> in the chimney and get up onto the roof... And then you meet this dude. Smiles McGee. Uh, he looked like the Grim Reaper for a second. Yeah. We, we cannot. Artorius is a character in the game now, but he is only available with the DLC. And you actually get to fight him. And I'm not going to spoil anything about it. If you want to do that, you can do it on your own and freaking. Eventually, we'll we will be doing that when we when we get the DLC. We just don't have it right now, so. Yeah, but basically, this means that we can't fight the four king. Oh, oh no. Can't you jump down there? No, uh, maybe, but I am not. I'm not going to risk it. Let's go down here and then out. Yeah, so I'm going to open up the seal just so we have new, easy back and forth. Yeah, easy back and forth to New Londo. Because I don't want to run through all of these ghosties again. And besides, the cutscene is kind of cool. Right, I guess this is a seal. And? Open the floodgates. I think it pours into the Valley of Drakes, doesn't it? Yeah. And all of that water is now gone. Fuck 
game is very, very gorgeous at times. Mm-hmm. It's really, I said this before, but it's really cool how everything just seems to connect. The dots. Yes. Okay, so. <clears throat> um, yeah, this is the Valley of Drakes. Hmm. Oh, oh, hey. Composite bow. Yeah, like, like we need that. <laughs> we might. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be useful to have a bow. Composite bow, At does that point. go scale off your strength? I don't know. It might. No, I don't think so. I think I... Composite bow. It does scale off a string. Oh, snap. I was right. Because I'm thinking, like, in a lot of games, you like, you, when you get a composite bow, it's like a strength weapon instead of, um... A dexterity weapon? Yeah. It's never quite as good as the dexterity ones, but it's still nice for you to have. There's one other item that I'm forgetting here. I think I have to walk around... Not there. I have to go straight. Go through a few corridors. And then I think I'll homeward bone back to Firelink. Ah, I'm gonna bone it back. Soul of a pro Oh! Ceiling ghosts! Still not quite what I'm thinking of, but you know what? That'll do. What were you thinking of? Curse Bite Ring. Oh, yeah. That's in there somewhere. It's not like you really need it. One thing you'd need it for at this point would be the fight against Seath, but I mean, just stack humanities and be careful. Wrong bonfire shoot. Yeah, oh. we haven't rested any bonfires since, so... Oh, well, it's fine. We have the Lord Vessel. Let's go up to the Undead Parish. Wherever that bonfire happens to be. I think it's the one above Andre. Yeah, I think. Because the only other one in the area is... The I don't altar. think you're right, son. The only other bonfire in the in the Undead Parish is the one in front of the Sunlight Altar, and that's... Labeled Sunlight Altar. Yeah, exactly. Yep. All right. That is really nice. Oh. I still never killed the Titanite Demon in Orlando. Oh, yeah. There's a Titanite Demon in... But it's pretty much the same as this one, isn't it? He's tougher. Uh, He's much tougher. But I also think he responds. Oh. He might... I forget. I know all of the Titanite demons in Sense Fortress respond. And I think that guy responds. Because I remember killing him on Nick Stambul. And then, like, he revives. That's a good Titanite farming spot. Because it's oh. pretty near um, a bonfire, so... Mm hmm. Dark Root Garden. Detour. Uh, you go to the right, up around here. You'll see a you path can, down. Yeah, path down. Oh, well, we might want to get naked facts. so we can get that beetle. Because he's coming up, isn't he? You gotta be fast. I don't want to give up my sick shoes. Dude, they are pretty cool shoes. See that sparkle right there? That's another twinkling titanite bug beetle. And he digs away pretty quickly once he sees you coming, so you gotta get him. Uh, yeah, there we go. What's up? So, Two twinkling titanite be ready for that shows. because I don't. if he digs away, I don't think you can get him again. No, you he can. shows up. You can. He shows up again, it's he easy, goes away again. It's easier to come, to come up behind him. Yeah, you just have to like quit and enter the game again, I think, for him to show up again. Something like Something that. Something like that, yeah. And I, believe there's a... I like rolling in midair. Isn't there a black knight around here somewhere? Yep. And he also has my favorite shield around him. So I'm gonna go pick that up. The grass whatever shield. Grass crest shield. shield. Mm -hmm. The grass crest shield has pretty decent resistances, good stability. But the thing about it that I like most ah, fucking halberd knight, dude. It was the thing that I like about it most is that it increases your stamina regeneration. If I could stop, dude. Probably be easier if I had a shield to parry with, so I didn't have to fish for backstabs. Oh shit, missed him. Yeah, what? What? 
Oh, I got his halberd. Nice. I feel like that always drops. So I've never seen it not drop. Grass crush shield. Switch into that. Boom. Stamina regeneration up. There's also a bonfire down here in this cave that acts as a shortcut to the Valley of Drakes. And also New Londo. So I'm just going to rest here. We can level up a few times. We're going to need some more strength. Yeah, uh, that's good. 30 strength, yeah. I need to get more endurance soon. But we're not going to go into the Valley of Drakes right now. We need to go find Sif and go fight Great Wolf Sif, who has what we need because Artorius is kind of not here anymore. Yeah. So, on the way, we're going to go fight the Hydra down here in Darkroot Basin. But we're going to do that next, next time. time. So, because we're out of time. So we'll see you guys next time. We go kill the Hydra and some other bitches. <laughs>